Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video guys. I hope you're doing fantastic as usual, man. And today guys, I am going to be reviewing some of the things which I learned in the book called The Times, The 10X Rule by Grant Cardin, guys. You know, I don't know if you've read the book before, but it's a very good book. Here's a book. This one, The 10X Man. So yeah guys, so this is going to be a, a part one of a multiple part series guys. For all you guys don't have time to read the book guys, I'm going to be sharing with you and simplifying some of the concepts in the book for you to understand and I'm going to be taking the most the most beneficial uh, things which I feel like I've learned from the books guys and I'm going to be giving it to you guys. Now if you're brand new guys, I don't edit my videos, all my videos are raw guys. And that's how I like. I like to keep it raw, man. The most important thing is the information which I'm, I'm giving you guys. And before I get started, guys, I was just outside writing my notes, man, and then it started to rain, man. I just, just have a look at how beautiful the rain is. Ready? Oh, did you see lightning, bro? Shit. Wow, did you hear that man? That's thunderstorms out there man. That's crazy man. So I gotta get back inside to film the video for you guys. But if you're brand new, please subscribe to my channel man. I release educational, spiritual, business videos man and entertainment videos man. So if you're brand new, be sure to smash the sub. Oh! Wait man, that sounds like a big lightning thing bro. But yeah guys, Make sure you subscribe to my channel guys. So let's get let's just jump right into it guys. The 10x rule by Grand Carton part one guys. Alright guys, so the first thing when you open the book before you start chapter one, he says this guys. Anyone that is anyone that suggests to me or to you to do less is either not a real friend or very confused guy. So anyone who tells you to do less than what you're already doing guys is either a fake friend guys or is very confused guys you know so nobody should be telling you you should be doing less you should be doing more guys you'll be doing more and more so that's really important to understand guys all right guys so let's get into it man so what is the 10x rule guys what is the 10x rule guy guys the 10x rule is the holy grail for people who want to be successful in life guys so the 10x rule is just basically the holy grail guys for people who want to be successful you know so it's um the 10x rule is the principle that all top achievers are using right now guys so all the people who are successful successful in business in marriage in spiritual in health guys in any area of life guys are using the 10x rule guys okay now the 10x rule explains why most people never attain or achieve success in their life guys now success can be defined many ways as financial success spiritual success familial success family success guys and there's so many different successes guys in life guys but the main one is finances guys you know so it explains why most people never attain the finances and never really really dominate in their business or their field guys so that's really important man so it explains all that guy it also shows us how to figure out how much effort oh guys man it's a thunderstorm man that's scrammy to it guys like i was saying guys it also explains guys and it shows us guys it explains how much effort we need to put forward in order to achieve our goals or desired goals guys so it explains all this how much effort because the biggest mistake which people make guys is they underestimate guys how much effort is required guys to um, achieve the goals guys you know so most people give up way too early without even they don't they don't um, anticipate guys anticipation like I've always said anticipation is key guys if you anticipate if you anticipate you're gonna dominate guys no exceptions guys and guys and um, the 10x rule guys will cost you literally nothing and it will gain you the whole world guys you know so knowing this rule it will it's free but once you know it guys you can gain 
pretty much anything you want in this physical plane guys all right man so let's just so the next thing guys is um it will help you stand out amongst all your peers and all the areas oh man i gotta take these glasses off i can't see man damn so guys yes as i was saying man the 10x rule guys will help you to stand out among your peers in any area of your life or your business so it will help you crush and dominate your business guys so as i always say man whatever your passion is guys you should be obsessed about this guys you should be looking to dominate not to complete yes i mean dominate don't compete guys Just absolutely destroy everything and dominate guys trust me this is really important guys so it explains how to dominate your areas guys you know so that's a really important key guys and it takes and it and guys it also says like it takes the same amount of energy guys to make 10,000 a year and 10 million or 10 million a year guys it takes the same amount of energy guys to have a great relate to have a great marriage as a poor marriage guys you know so basically explains all these concepts for us guys which we won't be diving in deeper into guys and another another thing is um wow man that's a lightning man it's too nice bro but guys the telex rule will ensure you are successful regardless of your edit. man come on man my phone fell down i like slammed my desk so my phone fell down whoa guys are you hearing this man that's insane man damn but I just love the smell of rain, you know, the smell of rain is fantastic, guys. All right, guys. So, as I was saying, guys, it works in every area of your life, guys, like spiritually, guys, physically, like mentally, emotionally, family, whatever, guys, area you're trying to improve in your life, it works in all areas. So that's really, really key, guys. It doesn't matter what area you're trying to improve, the 10X rule will help you improve any, any area you're working on, guys. The 10X rule is based on understanding guys how much effort is necessary to attain your vision your goals or whatever you set forward to do guys so it helps us understand how much effort is needed like i said before people underestimate how much effort guys which is needed to be exerted in order to achieve our goals guys all right man so it will um the second part of the um of the 10x rule guys is the mindset and the first one guys is basically you gotta do 10 times everything that you're currently doing guys you know 10 times more work 10 times more effort 10 times more goal setting just 10x everything guys that's basically what it means guys so the goals you set guys should move you to a better place where you were not before where you were where you haven't been before so it should be moving into a better place where you haven't been before or or should be unlocking new things in life guys you know so that's really important when you're setting your goals and we all know how important it is to set goals guys you know so if you're just wondering i'm just looking at my notes here guys i used small handwriting man and the flash is on guys for better lighting so it's kind of low-key blinding me but hey we'll just keep going man and guys another part is like if let's say you do achieve a success right and then you stop achieving it guys you know it's um it's basically like living the rest of your life on your last breath guys you know so you have to keep succeeding guys you have to keep going for it guys and the reason guys why we see a lot of successful people still hungry and still competing still dominating guys is whoa man damn man the reason why guys is because it makes them feel alive that's what keeps them going in life they're not doing it for the money anymore they're doing it for the love for the passion guys because it keeps them alive and it keeps them alert in life guys so if you ever wondered why rich people keep trying to get richer and richer it's because some of them might be doing for money but most of them are doing it to feel alive guys you know so that's the reason why guys so it's important to understand that guys That's nasty, bro.
and what else do I have for you guys and yes guys you should um, always keep the ball in your court in life what I mean by this guys you gotta take responsibility for everything that happens in your life guys don't play the victim mindset this is really important guys you have to play you have to take responsibility guys because if you're in the victim's mindset guys you can't change it but if you take responsibility guys now like if you if you go into a victim's mindset guys your brain automatically stops looking for solutions it just shuts all solutions down guys so this is why it's important guys to always be taking responsibility because if you take responsibility guys your, your brain will start looking for um solutions to fix it and to get you to a better place guys so always always keep the ball in your court guys take responsibility for everything man that's really important man you know what i'm saying and guys another thing is um you have to be obsessed with your craft guys you have to be obsessed with what you're doing guys you have to be all in guys you know and you have you cannot compete in your craft guys you have to totally dominate guys like i said you have to be willing to dominate not to compete you have to dominate yourself dominate your competition guys you have to dominate guys you know dominating is basically taking the throne becoming the king of that division guys you know what i'm saying it's almost like boxing guys there's only there's like four belts guys you know and the best one is the one with all the four belts he literally dominated he's not competing with all the competitors he's actually taking the belt so it's like that man you have to take success you have to absolutely dominate man man this wind is low key creeping me out man i'm not gonna lie but all right guys let's jump into it man um another thing which i have for you guys is you have to make um success the only option guys you know because it's the only way you can achieve it guys but if you have plan b and c guys you will never take it very seriously man so it has to be the only option you have to make it the only you have to burn all bridges guys it has to be the only options guys wait i'll be right back i gotta see this I gotta tell you bro those winds out there man they're violent as heck man so where was i up to guys yes i was saying guys it has to be your only option guys you cannot you cannot have a b plan and then have a c plan it has to be the only option guys and you um your desire to reach your goal is one of the most important parts of that goal one one of the most important factors guys of about reaching your dreams and your goals guys because the desire guys is what will make you hungry guys it will make you hungry to want to achieve the goal it will make you hungry to want to achieve and to attain guys so you need the hunger guys like I, like i've always said number one common demand denominator between all successful people is hunger guys you have to be hungry guys you have to want it man you have to be hungry so you have to maintain and increase and strengthen that hunger guys you know so that's really really important the desire guys and um Regardless of what whatever goal you require guys Yes, oh man, I gotta keep taking on these glasses damn man. So guys re regardless of what goal you are set out to achieve guys you you have What the fuck? Nah, man Guys, did you hear that man? I'm getting goosebumps, man. Nah, man. All the birds are like... Whew. Man, it sounds like someone's really angry, guys. Guys, I think I better end it there, man. I cannot focus with this, man. This is scaring the shit out of me, guys. So I really hope you enjoyed, man. If you're brand new, be sure to subscribe to my channel, guys. And I gotta go, man. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.